Hybrid Lighting. Discover Mirrorless recommends the LED hybrid lighting solution from Quantum called the Omicron. Omicron. Hey, hybrid photographers. How are you? It's Crockett here. First post of the new year. I had a couple breakthroughs actually this past week. I've been working with a rather wide variety of photographers on how we're going to help them create e-products as well as hybrid e-products. And one of the topics that keeps coming back up is LED lighting. So I want to let you know that I went into the studio for the first time yesterday and shot an entire job with LED lights only. I used no flash and I've got some pretty great results. Here are a couple of images that I shot in two different sessions yesterday. The first here, this little guy here, that's Pablo. Hey, Pablo. This is a piece that I'm creating for the convention that I speak at every year for kids sports portrait photographers as well as school photographers. Looks like they're going to be one of the first clusters to move completely into hybrid photography using LED lighting, some sort of audio recording tools, and looks like mirrorless cameras. There's no need for them to have DSLRs. Mirrorless is really the way to go. And take a look at these baseball pictures, right? If all these were done at a shutter speed of 125th or faster, wide open with an F2.8 Lumix zoom, and ISO is all the way up to 2500. Do not freak out. The ISO 2500 under a, a situation like that that's controlled is totally fine. Look, the quality's great. Let's zoom in on this one. This one was uh, ISO 1600. Here's one that's ISO 3000. And the quality's great, guys. So no raw. I only shoot JPEG, as you know, of course, video as well. But Here's what leads me to a question. Uh, I got a couple of emails here, one from my buddy Dan Johnson over in Indiana saying, hey, Will, all this LED stuff, where do I start? I see you're using a lot of it. Well, what I'd like to do is I'd like to tell you, stop, don't, not yet. I'm still investigating and I'm testing and I'm looking at all the options. So don't think that because we're moving forward and in, in going into this LED thing full blast that you should. You have to, have to realize that, you know, this is what we do for a living. Our consulting company actually helps develop these kind of things. And a lot of the equipment that I get, I don't have to pay for, right? I can use it, test it, and then I can send it back where I, I'm not feeling really comfortable right now telling you to, hey, go out and spend $4,000 on LED lights. So don't do it. Sit tight. DiscoverMirrorless.com and ShootSmarter.com are merging together as one. So that means that we'll be presenting you brand new info every day on Discover Mirrorless. And there will be lots of LED content there. And in fact, I'm I'm bringing in a photographer, full-time uh, uh, Peter Friedman is going to come in and help us uh, describe how he's going to convert his kids' portrait studio from flash only, as well as available light, by the way, into LED. Because the goal is we want to be able to set up whatever portrait lighting we want to, right? Or kids' sports event lighting and decide if we're going to shoot photo or we're going to shoot video, right? Okay, and you want to see something cool now that you've stayed this long to watch my, me blab on your computer? I'll show you the first hybrid e-product. I'm going to unveil this next week at the PMA conference. This is the first talking trading card that's auto-edited. Now, this, this piece here uh, is the template for a piece that is being auto-edited, but this is the future of volume photography. Watch this. Hi, I'm Juan Pablo Maldon. I play second base. My favorite team is Chicago Cubs. I love baseball. Hybrid Lighting. Discover Mirrorless recommends the LED hybrid lighting solution from Quantum called the Omicron. Omicron.